Hey y'all, uh, somebody uh, commented about how I had uh, like a background in uh, the terminal. It's quite easy to do, um, doesn't take any special talents, that's for sure. Uh, so we'll just open the terminal to start with. And what you want to do uh, to be on the safe side, safe, in case something goes wrong, is just go to profiles and just new and just based on default is fine. And just type in whatever, I'll type in MIB, and we'll just close that for now, okay? Now, uh, we have to find a picture. I have one uh, in my pictures folder. So let's open GIMP, if you have GIMP installed. I have the latest uh, 2.8. And we'll just uh, file open, I think I opened it recently. Open recent. Ah, yes, the penguin. Okay. Um, first of all, we want to, we'll just leave that and we'll create a, a new template, uh, oh, good, templates, right, 800 by 600 is fine, um, background color, we'll go to foreground, which will be black, I think that's correct, okay, we'll go back to the penguin, and we'll use our magic wand or whatever they call it now. Fuzzy select, whatever. Okay. And we'll just select the white area. Then you go to edit, uh, select invert. And you press control C to copy. And then we'll go to edit, paste as new layer. There he is there. Actually, let me con uh, control Z undo that. And I'll we'll undo all this here. I forgot so I'm gonna resize. So we'll just you can hit the Alt key and scale image. And I'll go to I'll let I have it locked so it'll be 60 by 71. You don't want it too big. Okay, now we'll select with the, the wand, or that's whatever it's called, and select invert, and then now control C go back to edit, paste as new layer. There it is. Now you can use the move tool. Move them around a bit. Stay there. You don't want them too big because uh, it gets in the way. And we'll go to the background here on the right side and the opacity, opacity 75 or so. Um, and then you just alt export and we'll just use, uh, let's go to desktop and uh, Term, term one or something. Uh, I just accept the default settings. Export and uh, order is again is going to disappear on me. Okay. Can view uh, view your image. So we'll open terminal again. Control T. Edit profiles. And the one you made and say edit background. Uh, use an image and just for the purpose of this you can move it later is that open I'll close the terminal back down oops rip back to terminal and we'll tell it to use in the default section this one close it again there we go now we have our little uh, embedded image so you change something like uh, Etsy and do a list, okay? You'll see that the image will repeat every uh, 600 pixels, I guess it would be. And that's it. That's all you have to do. And if you don't like it, just go back to default or you can change and you do whatever you wish. Um, that's how I, uh, and you just see every time that it moves around but that's all that's all you have to do so that's it okay any questions or comments feel free to ask i'm sure it's it's very basic to do but um i hope this helps somebody out there uh that's wondering how you would do something like that i mean i, I know there's other um, things you can do with ascii and stuff but there's a ton of those uh, videos as well okay so thanks so much for watching and uh have a good one and we'll talk to you later bye for now